Hey babies, today I'm teaching you how to make shrimp tuna pasta salad. It's a real easy recipe and it doesn't take long. Now what I've done is I've chopped up my green peppers and my onions because we all know how we like to make our own tuna fish salad. And I took the tails off of my shrimp and cut them down because I like a meaty salad. You know, anything for me is meat and it's healthy. I also boiled a half a package of bow tie noodles. And I slow boiled them with some butter and water. And I rinsed off my noodles because I didn't want the starch in it. And I added it to my bowl. I also boiled eight eggs. And I chopped them down when they were cool. So, that's what my bowl is looking like right now. I have not added my other stuff in yet. I like to make it in this bowl right here because it's not too much and it's not too little. I used four cans of tuna fish. Two with al bacor tuna in water. And two with tuna and oil because I prefer tuna and oil but I'm starting to get into albacore tuna because it's a little higher class or higher quality tuna fish and what I do is I add my seasonings with my turmeric and and my pepper and my crushed peppers and my Mrs. Dash and my ground onion powder and my ground garlic powder I like to add you know just a little bit you know me I like my seasonings so I just sprinkle that on top how I like it it's got a little sauce in it and you know just my seasonings you know me I try to do it up I try to eat Try to find more healthier recipes and more healthier to eat because one, I know I need to lose some weight. I lost a couple pounds from being in the hospital. This is my time of year, the summertime, and here in Buffalo, New York, I don't know about nobody else, but the weather didn't get, get good for me until June, so I'm just... Recently cutting my heat off. Yeah, I know others can do it, but hey, I like to be warm. So, when I cut my heat off for good, this is my summertime things that I like to do. I like to eat a lot of different salads because they're not heavy. I like to buy fruit and cut it down. You know, to eat as a snack. I'm going to start going to the gym and working out a little bit. I got some things to do to make Donna feel better being Donna. So, that's where I'm at with me today. And I hope it works better for you all also. One of the ingredients I use... And I'm opening up my bottle. I know you probably can't see. It's not much in there. But I don't really put a lot of mustard in my salad anyhow. So for me, try to see if I can squeeze enough out. I don't really put a lot in it. Because I'm not really a, a mustard person when it comes to salad. So hopefully that's enough. I don't know. I'm not quite sure yet. With the tuna and the oil, I put the whole can in with the oil. With the tuna and the water, I dipped the tuna out and flaked it up in my bowl. I didn't add the water yet. But I have some. That was just store brand mustard. Mustard is mustard to me. I'm not a big person on mustard. That was Kurtz. I mean, I could use any store brand. Using Heinz Sweet Relish in the squeeze bottle. 
just to give it a little twist. Yeah, just little tickles. A little twist. And I'm using Heinz hot dog relish. That looks like it has a little mustard in it. I don't know if it does, but I know it has that little twang to it. So I like to squeeze a little of that in there too. Just a couple squeezes, not nothing precise where you have to have, you know, so much of this and so much of that. Just enough to, and this is why I like to use my knife, just enough to stir it through. I mean, yes, I know the spoon can do it, but for me, taking a knife and taking it through little by little, that's good for me. I like my food to look good and it tastes good. That shrimp and tuna, that's healthy eating, baby. And then the pasta just be the little extra. So here's a pasta bar. I like what they call one pan, one pot meal. some price right whip, whip dressing it's, uh, it's compared to um, Miracle Whip and I know a lot of people like using mayonnaise and if that's what you like to use go ahead I was brought up on Miracle Whip salad dressing so I more like the salad dressing mayonnaise is a little sweeter than salad dressing My stuff to be a little more mm, with salad dressing. Some people mix salad dressing with mayonnaise, and if that's your flavor, go right ahead. Rheumatoid arthritis is saying, mm-mm, baby. I'm going to put this on my knee and look down in my salad as I'm mixing it through with the knife. Ooh-wee. Uh -oh. Stretch out my fingers some, because... RA is saying no baby and I got to get it through here. Get it done and get it ready because I see after this I ain't going to be able to do no more of this tonight. That's what RA do it. Crinkle your fingers up. Or it stretches it out and does my toes too. Okay. Nothing I said I was going to do today.
got them. And I am finished with my salad. I will put it in the refrigerator for maybe about 15, 20 minutes because I'm being about greedy because I'm about hungry. It might not even make it in there that long. Let it get a little chill on it. Put up my ingredients and I'm good to go. So if you like my video, thumbs up. If you don't, thumbs down. And why hit that subscribe button. I appreciate you. I love you. Bye-bye.